Hey everyone, today we're gonna to be checking out our new nine key smart keypad. All right, our packaging is gonna come with everything that we need, including our nine key smart keypad, a cable so you can hook up your keypad to your computer, a quick tip guide, and then a more detailed user manual. Our keypad is also gonna be a mechanical keypad, so you'll have that awesome mechanical sound. Before you get started setting up your keypad to your computer, you're gonna to need to download the software that is laid out in their quick tip guide. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. Our keypad is gonna have six functional layers and nine NKRO keys. You're gonna have six customizable functional layers for different uses. You can use one for gaming, one for designing. It's completely up to you. You can even switch between the layers by scrolling the mouse in the floating window area or you can just switch layers automatically based on the application you are using. The nine non-conflict keys with macros are gonna allow you to press or hold multiple keys simultaneously. This is gonna give you an accurate response with high speed with a new level for gaming and typing. This is gonna have a user-friendly interface and it's even gonna have this awesome floating window. This real-time floating window is going to help you never forget the function of the key that you are being used in the moment. This one-handed macro mechanical keyboard can make you work faster and more efficient. It can even make your gaming experience more comfortable and smooth. The keypad is going to have a small, slim design, so it's going to be perfect for anyone on the go. This macro keyboard is also going to support OTA online upgrades. You're going to have timely push messages that are going to help remind you to update the firmware so you have more useful functions. This is going to be easy to share by exporting and importing your settings for different backups. You can even share your settings with your friends. While you're customizing your keypad, just remember to hit the flash keypad when you're done. That way it saves all the changes you made.